Matt Hun here with MDH Technologies. Today, I'd like to discuss passwords a little bit. As an IT guy, over the years, one of the most common things uh, that I've run into is uh, maybe users forgetting their passwords, um, things of that nature. So, uh, and that's something pretty common today. Um, every website and everything you do basically requires a password and a username because there are different complexity requirements and, and different security protocol in effect um, one site might make you have a password that's at least 10 characters and the other site may make you use numbers or letters or a combination of stuff you know special characters and things so it's impossible really to use the same password for everything um, people these days uh, try not to do that I think as a rule of thumb but there is a really great way uh, that you can have tons of different passwords manage them all without having to remember all of them <clears throat> there's a great software package called LastPass that I'm gonna be discussing today and there's a free version of this thing and it's a great tool for people to manage their passwords. <clears throat> I'm going to take you over to the YouTube page for LastPass and we're going to watch this quick one minute video that does a great job of introducing the products and I may touch on one or two of the other features here in just a moment. So here you see a user who's trying to log in and can't remember his password. So he's upset and frustrated, as all of us get when we can't remember a password. So this last pass will allow you to keep multiple passwords and basically access all of those with just one master password. So the application is a browser plugin and once you install the thing, it will uh, basically ask if you want to remember your password the next time and you can add it to what's called your vault once once a password and a username is added to the vault you have several options you can have it automatically log in whenever you visit that page uh, you can um, just have it fill in the information and it'll still allow you to hit the, the go or the enter button um, so there, there are several options available there. Uh, LastPass uh, information is encrypted and decrypted locally, uh, so you know that your information is safe. Um, it, it will sync passwords and username across several computers or devices. So if you're um, working on multiple machines, a home office, and a regular office, laptop, desktop, that sort of thing, um, you can sync the information across multiple devices. Once again, you can download the free version of this from the LastPass website and it'll work with Chrome, Firefox, or Internet Explorer and uh, the, whole, the whole great thing about this is that once you enter your master username and password it will remember everything going forward and if you ever forget a password or just need to recall what something is you can actually log into their website and you can see a list of uh, your usernames and passwords there as well so you don't actually have to install the app to manage your passwords so if you're on a public computer maybe at you know an internet cafe or a computer you're borrowing or something and you want to be able to log in somewhere uh, you could uh, log into the LastPass website and retrieve passwords that way as well without actually having to install the software so um, we've used this um, over the last several years and never had a problem uh, security is always something uh, to think about and changing passwords regularly is a good idea keeping passwords uh, that have several characters with combinations of letters, numbers, and special characters is always a good idea. 
uh, anything you can do to uh, make it more difficult uh, to hackers and uh, people who would uh, try to crack your password is always a good idea because the more effort that somebody has to take to break in uh, to your systems or uh, you know your your, your web-based applications the better it is the less likely uh, they are to go after you so keeping those things in mind LastPass we think is a good way uh, for users to manage passwords once again, this has been Matt Hun with MDH Technologies discussing the LastPass application. Thank you.